Hello everyone. Today I will make an interesting program in C language to input electricity unit charges and calculate total electricity bill. Now let's start. Click on file menu. Click on new. Now the question is program to input electricity unit charges and calculate electricity bill So here is the conditions. I am making a multi line comment. For first fifty units, piece zero point. Five zero unit for next hundred units rupees zero point seven five per unit. For next hundred units, rupees one point two zero per unit. And for the unit above two fifty. Rupees one point five zero per unit. Now let's see how to solve this question. Now I'm finishing the multi-line comment. So now, first I'm writing the header files of C language. Hash is our preprocessor directory, which includes an header file, standard input-output header file, which includes standard input-output functions. Like printf and scanner. Another header file is conio dot h, which means console input output header file, which include functions like clear stream and get switch. Now I'm writing the main function of program. Void is a data type which doesn't return any value. And main is the main function of program. That is the beginning of program. Now the question is to input electricity unit charges. So first we have to take a variable unit, and next we have to calculate the total bill. So now I am taking two variables. Float is the data type in which I am taking the variable. Unit and unit comma bill. Now 
now clear screen function help us to clear the screen now i am giving a message enter the electricity unit charges now i'm taking the input by using the format specifier of float that is percent f and unit close now the question is for the first 50 units charge will be rupees 0.50 per unit now it is a conditional statement question we are solving it by using ladder if if unit is less than or equals to 50 then bell equals to unit star 0.50 now the next condition is for the next 100 units charge will be rupees 0.75 per unit now i'm writing the ladder of statement like else if unit is less than or equals to 50 plus 100 that is 150 less than 150 per unit then bill will calculate according to the given condition so in this particular condition first 50 unit will be charged according to rupees 0.50 so the amount will be Rupees twenty five plus unit minus fifty because we have already added the amount of rupees twenty five of using fifty units. Now for the next hundred units, rupees zero point seven. Again for the next condition. else for the next 100 units now the unit is 150 150 plus 100 that is 250 or unit less than or equals to 250 now the bill charge according to the given condition for the first 50 units rupees 25 and for the next Hundred units to be seventy-five. So the total charges to be hundred plus unit minus how many total units you have to subtract? That is one fifty. Star one point two zero. Per unit. Now, the last condition for above two fifty, the charge will be rupees one point five zero. So, this condition will be in else, else bill equals to for the first fifty units rupees twenty five, for the next hundred units rupees seventy five. For the next hundred units, rupees one twenty. So total will be two twenty plus bracket open unit minus two fifty star one point five zero. 
now the all the conditions are complete now i am printing the electricity bell unit used percent f flash t electricity bill percent f now first is unit comma bill get ch is used to hold the output of program i am saving the file i am compiling the file to check errors there is no error not running the file now i am entering the unit like i have entered 125 so unit used is 125 and electricity bill is 81 rupees 0.25 now i am running again to check another condition above 250 like i have entered 300 unit used now the bill is to be 295 that's all i hope you like this video and understand the program properly thank you so much